Hi, I'm Carmen Shamas. I'm your astrologer. Today I'll be talking about Tuesday, the 12th of December. Today the moon is in Sagittarius. There's a new moon, uh, meaning the sun and the moon will be will meet in Sagittarius around uh, 11.30 p.m. Universal Time. Uh, so this makes it a wonderful, beautiful day if you're Sagittarius, if you're Aries, if you're a Leo. How's it going to be for all signs? Aries, definitely you're a very strong sign. Everything seems to be wonderful. Everything seems to be beautiful. There's a lot of fun going around. You're very um, uh, creative and definitely uh, you cannot stand still. So many, um, uh, uh, it's, it's the energy that you have and the positive vibes that you have that will make a big difference today. So go ahead and enjoy. Moving to Taurus, definitely there's a need for Taurus to make things right, uh, meaning that if you have something pending, today is the day to get things done and to talk about them and to get actually these things um already settled down maybe you need to uh, ask for an appointment and because it's a new moon uh, definitely there's a way out definitely there's a final answer just make uh, sure that you have all your uh, necessary documents along with you moving to gemini it can be a rough day because uh, the sun the moon and mars are opposing your sign which can uh, all of this can push you to be a little bit um, impulsive so you don't want to do that you have to be to the contrary you have to be very patient and think twice before you say anything uh, on the positive side there may be a nice a good up, up appointment or interview waiting for you Cancer, it's a very long day. Things may turn out to be exactly as you want, or maybe you may think that it's um, uh, too overwhelming. In all cases, you have nothing to worry about. It's going to be a beautiful, beautiful day. The moon is your ruling planet, and uh, it's a new moon. So basically, there is a big, uh, something is developing, something is blooming in your uh, life, whether it's uh, related to health or related to work or um, your mental health, whatever it is, it's going to be perfect. Moving to Leo, what can I say, Leo? It's a gorgeous day. Uh, definitely there's something uh, cooking. And uh, if you're planning on meeting someone, if you're planning on getting in touch with someone, if you're planning on going to a meeting, this is a beautiful day that can prove to be a to be successful if it's meant to be yours you're going to take it if it doesn't happen definitely definitely um it's not yours so don't feel bad about it because the quality of time is superior so if it's yours you can get it today uh and if you were born on the 13th 14th of august the the super effects of the new moon is yours Let's move now to Virgo. So it can be a little bit tough or maybe a little bit uh, annoying or just a little bit emotional for you today. It's because the um, new moon falls in the fourth house. That's where family is. That's where your emotions are. That's where your own feelings go. Uh, so maybe you're thinking about um, uh, maybe your friends, your family, your house, your home. Uh, maybe about shopping, about getting things done, about uh, flying, about uh, going a trip, receiving people at home, about cooking, or can be just thinking about yourself. It's a new moon, so big things, um, small things actually mean a lot to you. So it depends what you want. You can do anything you want for yourself. You can pamper yourself and you can make big decisions. It's a beautiful day. I think it's a beautiful day. Moving to Libra, Libra, this is a fast beat day. Uh, if there's someone uh, creative in, in these signs, in the zodiac, um, uh, Libra can be one of the most creative. Um, Libra is, per se, is creative, per sign, let's say. So today with the moon, new moon in the third house, um, uh, this actually will give you a lot of uh, fire. The flame is on, uh, greatly on, hugely on. So it can actually uh, light your creative powers. Uh, you can be get to be so um, rewarded and definitely inspired and definitely so active. 
So your work can be super, super, super fast and your work can be very efficient and you can do almost anything you want. You can even do more than you want. Let's move now to Scorpio. Uh, definitely, it's a beautiful day. The, the effects of uh, planet Venus are still in your sign and you're still a very lucky sign. The effects of the new moon in the second house of money uh, will prove to be uh, very favorable and uh, they will give you great uh, inspiration. So this can be one of those beautiful days that will make um, Scorpio one of the best candidates for anything. So make sure that uh, you choose right. Planet Venus uh, actually uh, makes you very lucky if you were born on the 30th, 31st of October or even 1st of November. Uh, let's move now to Sagittarius. Sagittarius, what can I say? This is a happy new year for you. Um, it's, it's something different that can give you great excitement. Maybe you don't know why, but this is why, because it's a new moon in your sign. This happens once a year. So this should make a big difference. Maybe you'll notice that you... You, you're more mature, that you know how to react, that you are more forgiving, more permissible. You don't care much about um, uh, little simple things. So it's in a way, you seem to be more mature. And definitely, there's a page that you're going to turn and you're going to start a new page. Anything you want to be done today can be done. So it's up to you to decide what you do. And definitely, it's a lucky day. Just be very careful if you were born on the 4th or 5th of uh, December. That's because of the effects of planet Mars. Moving to uh, Capricorn. Capricorn, this is a slow day. Things may not be... Uh, that uh, fast as you think. Uh, things actually turn, take a turn, different turn, maybe to the slow turn. Maybe they disappoint you in a way, maybe because your expectations are so high, so don't go there. Just be, just take it simple, work on yourself and double check on your bookings, on your travels, whatever you want to do. Uh, don't um, plan big, not today. So the new moon actually is for you, uh, for you personally. Pamper yourself, do whatever you want to do for yourself, um, don't expect things from others, and please double check on your bookings. Aquarius, um, it's a very happy day. Aquarians should be very happy today. There are so many things awaiting you. I think you will enjoy so many situations and uh, probably you will make things uh, more happy happier around wherever you are in your community. So this is going to be a very rewarding day. Um, maybe you want to write something, you want to write down something that you uh, get inspired with. Um, and this can be a very sociable day if you really want to open your doors and welcome new people or welcome new ideas to your life. It's a very happy day. Pisces, uh, it's uh, a day where you can actually um, be the role model if you want to do things the right way. Um, of course, adding to it this touch of, uh, uh, of charm and creativity that you have uh, and beauty. Uh, today is a beautiful day to impress others, to impress yourself. And if you don't care about that, this is a beautiful day just to enjoy and uh, to do your work efficiently. The moon and the sun and planet Mars will push you, will push you to do more and more. And you may feel a little bit tired about that. Don't lose confidence, even though uh, Venus will help you from Scorpio. Uh, but still, we cannot forget that Saturn is in your sign and Neptune also. So there may be some... Uh, uh, some annoyance going around, but you can do it. You're inside, you're a very strong sign. Outside, people may see you as very romantic. You cry a lot, uh, but actually you're very sentimental. You're very strong inside and uh, you're like a mountain that nobody can move because actually you're the one who helps everyone. So that's because you're strong inside. So this new moon maybe will help you to go inside, build uh, more energy, recharge, and be able to face families and face uh, work and life with happiness. There's something new knocking on your door there. 
Okay, let's wrap it up with born on the 11th and born on the 12th with a new moon around uh, with you all this year. Something new, very big is knocking on your door, different year. Uh, maybe you're continuing with the same projects uh, along this year. Uh, but maybe I think astrologically something will turn around and um, you'll be surprised, happily surprised with a new direction or maybe... Uh, some new um, info, you know, um, that you will receive and that will help you grow more. So it's going to be a beautiful, beautiful year. Very different. It's a new moon, which means that something uh, totally innovating will knock on your door. Around the uh, middle of 2024, you may get uh, a chance, an opportunity to seal a deal or get uh, some great news. Wishing you all the best. See you tomorrow. Enjoy. Bye-bye.